this video we'll be looking at how to do overshoots in Harmony. Now overshoots are important because anything just that just simply goes from point A to point B ends up looking fairly mechanical. So usually what you want to do when you're animating is to try to overshoot the final resting point and then slowly roll back to that final resting point. An example of that would be a large truck or jeep that's rolling down the highway and if it quickly slams on its brakes, the majority of that truck is going to still lurch forward and then kind of roll back. And this kind of basic physics you want to add to almost any animation that you want it to look natural and organic. Okay, select the Transform tool in the Tools toolbar. We're going to move our cursor on the timeline to, key, uh, to frame 21. Let's add a keyframe here by selecting right-clicking on the, on the timeline and selecting Insert Keyframe. Uh, on Windows, that's also shortcut F6. And now we can grab our ball here. Hit shift to make sure it moves in a horizontal line. So that's going to be our overshoot. And we'll move to frame 31. Add a keyframe. Click shift again. And move it a little further back. Okay, let's play our animation. Still looks very mechanical. So we'll add some ease ins and ease outs using the set ease for multiple parameters tool. Okay, in the left time ratio, I'm going to put 80 for the first keyframe for a large ease in, and a moderate ease out of 50 in the left time ratio for the next keyframe, and a small ease in of 25 in the right time ratio of the same keyframe, and a final ease out of 25. Uh, as our animation goes from overshoot to final resting point. All right, let's play our animation. And we'll get something with a more natural looking overshoot.